Okay, so today we're continuing my review of Toys That Teach. This is by Safariology and it is The Life Cycle of a Frog. This is a cool kit and unlike some of the other Safariology kits, this has more than four pieces in it. It has five pieces and is for ages four and up. Comes from Safari Limited. So it's a choking hazard for young kids. You want to keep an eye on them. Three and younger, this is not a recommended toy for them. Some of these things do look like they would want to put them in their mouth, especially these eggs here. Then you have uh, the tadpoles themselves. And beyond that, we add the tadpole without gills. So this metamorphosis is well represented here. We have tadpole with legs, still has part of the tail. That's why it's considered a tadpole. And then the adult frog, which is very familiar to most children. And uh, these are all hand painted. So the one that you get may look a little different. Each one uh, has artistic license taken a little bit. On the back, there's lots of reading to do if you'd like to. There's some details in several languages about the uh, frog, the tadpole, the eggs, and so on. Comes from Safari Limited in Miami, Florida. SafariLimited.com. I purchased these for full price on Amazon. So let's take a look. This is the whole kit out of the box now. Every stage, you can find frogs eggs and toad eggs these are amphibians so they reproduce in water they lay their eggs in water and they begin their lives in water and then they grow and move on to land and this kit does a fantastic job of demonstrating that this little glob of eggs here very realistic looking but it is a hard resin plastic let's go over them piece by piece here this is the egg pack as i mentioned before if you're near a pond or even a deep puddle in spring you'll find uh, standing water with amphibian eggs in it. Question is, what is going to hatch out of this? What will these eggs become? Because they can be toads, they could be frogs, they could even be salamander eggs. So this is a valuable kit and it's going to teach your children exactly uh, what the stages of growth and development are. Once it hatches out of the egg, you get a tadpole. These little rascals will swim around and they'll eat algae and they'll eat greens and decaying material. There is some food resource here in the tail, and these tails are translucent. You can see my finger right through it. There are tiny nubs of the hind legs on the back here. The mouth is very small, and the eyes are large. And uh, now we move on to the next step. The cool thing is this happens pretty fast. Uh, the mouth on this one though seems a little large to me tadpoles with the hind legs on them here without the front legs developed i would expect the mouth to look a little smaller but uh, it's still a cool little step in growth and development here so again the tail is translucent looks like it's made of two parts here and we'll move on to the next step now you have all four legs this thing needs to be on the surface so it needs a little patch a moss or a log or something to sit on, but they stay near water so that they can escape predation. Very few of these actually reach maturity because everything eats them, including other frogs, I'm sad to say. But uh, the tail is going away and the next step, you'll notice too that uh, the webbing on the hind feet, I think there should be a little more of that, but uh, it's pretty cool. This thing will sit flat and uh, the skin texture is pretty good for this type of uh, frog at this stage of development. I think we're dealing with bullfrogs here. And here's the adult frog. Now, I think they got a little sloppy on this one. You got some black paint on the left leg there. They uh, have the seams left prominent on the forearms there where uh, this thing was molded. And it's all one color. The top of the frog is all green as is the bottom. I would expect the bottom to be that light cream color. And uh, they did a great job around the eyes, making it uh, gold around the iris there. And overall, this is going to be a nice kit, but I would have liked to see a two-tone color on it, green on the back. Maybe the ears should be uh, a little gold, and then the underside should be a cream color. Great informational kit, however. I'm still going to give this probably five stars. I purchased it for full price on Amazon. And uh, it has every stage here, and I like that they added the fifth stage. Frogs are fun. Kids are curious about them. Easy to find in spring. I definitely recommend the kit. Thanks for watching.